Hi everybody and welcome to day three of practice here at Clemson University. Yesterday we took a look at the offensive line and the defensive line. Today we're going to take you to the linebackers. Yes, that's where defensive coordinator Kevin Steele is the position coach. And while these guys may be a little bit of an unknown, Coach Steele feels like he's got some talent to work with at the position. Just talk a little bit about your linebacking core. As, as Coach Sweeney has said, kind of coming into camp, kind of an unknown group, but it looks like you got some talent to work with. Well, I mean, in college football, you know, we you, you go through that from time to time because we can't sign them to contracts. They graduate. So we're used to that, and, and we know what we've got. We've got good players. Uh, they bought in. They understand the process. And uh, when we line up, I guarantee you we'll have a Sam Mike and we're ready to play. Let's right, talk just a little bit about uh, that depth and what happens here over the next couple of weeks to establish that depth. Well, competition. Competition does because competition makes them better. You know, we got Scotty Cooper and, and Daniel Andrews and uh, uh, Quan and Christian at Sam Backer. Those are three good players that know what they're doing. They've been in the system now for a while, uh, two spring practices, now into their second fall. And then at Mike Backer with uh, Carico and, and uh, Justin Parker and uh, Shuey, you know, that gives us some competition. And then Tig Willard at Will and, and Brandon May. So we, we that's the older group. And then we've got some young guys that are vying for playing time. Hi, right, talk about first day in shells. I mean, you get to see him put some pads on finally. Yeah, it was good. You know, and, and um, you know, we, we continued to make progress today. The, the, the biggest thing is when you put the shells on and the physical part starts coming into play, then you start seeing where guys are mentally. And, uh, you know, it's one thing in shorts. It's another thing when you, when you have the, the, the contact factor to, to, to bring in there because that fatigue starts coming in. And, you know, I, 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 we're going to be a tough team, um, you know, but as I told the team, schemes don't win. Players executing schemes win. And so we, we've got to be smart. We, gotta be, we should be a smarter team. We've got to be a smarter team. And, and uh, you know, we had a few mistakes today from some guys that uh, – some little things that, that can cost you. Uh, so uh, hopefully we can continue to, to improve in some areas. And, and, uh, but as far as uh, practice, uh, I love the intensity. I love, the tempo was good. Uh, it's fun to watch those big guys up front because neither side is intimidated of each other. And, uh, you know, that's how you get better. Can't say enough about uh, uh, the way the secondary is, is catching the ball right now. And, and uh, the linebackers are, you know, competing big time. Uh, and Jamie Harper and Andre Ellington, I'm just going to tell you, they show up with overalls on every day. If everybody worked like those two guys, this would be the easiest job in America. Blue collar, tough. Love to practice, uh, fun to coach.